everyone. Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of Monday Minutes. Hey guys. Hi. Today we are here with Tori as well as Nicole and I'm Bree and we are going to be talking about healthy eating. I love it. Yes. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> so we all love food but in the winter time it gets a little tricky to be able to actually stay motivated when yeah. you're cooking. We have long days. It's a busy time of the year right now for Top Knot. We get home like when it's dark outside. Yeah. So we'll the start. The short days. Yeah, yeah. the short <laughs> days. Sometimes we stay overnight. The short days though, it's still dark outside. So I want to know Tori first, how do, how do you motivate yourself to put in the effort when it comes to cooking? Okay, so I've got, I have two minds. The first mind is that I used to be really good with having just basic, like almost like a uniform meal that I mm -hmm. love. So I would cook a piece of salmon and then I would put like a really nice garnish on it, whether it was dill or whether it was soy sauce with like a marinade or whatever. It would like really spice it up. But then like, um, and make a quick salad and maybe steamed vegetables. Okay. Super simple. There you go. Take the piece out of piece of salmon out of the freezer in the morning. You're good. Okay. Then top knot hit. <laughs> <laughs> and I had no time to do this and go home and take that. I would forget to take the salmon out. Yeah. There would be no salmon in the freezer when I looked. <laughs> Um, you know, that piece of lettuce might be a little too questionable to mm, eat. So I actually went into a really like hard phase of getting, um, a takeout food, yeah, which yeah, ended yeah. up not being healthy and yeah. it wasn't very good at all. But I've since kind of revamped myself for 2020 and I now do a meal prep plan Yes, where I actually purchase meals that are already made yep. and I just get to heat them up and they're super healthy. They're cooked for me. Um, I'm going to shout out on the run meals. Like they're <laughs> fantastic. We'll tag you in this. <laughs> But they have saved my life and they're delicious. So um, I'm testing it out right now, yeah. but I think that it's something that I'm really going to stick with. Awesome. It sounds like a good It's plan. a long winded answer. Yeah. It kind of like that. You know what? That's your food journey. Exactly. <laughs> How about you guys? Well, I like I still live at home, so um, we you still like home. Right now. We do. Oh. We still eat. <laughs> <Bless you. laughs> we still like every night we gather around the table and we share our meals kind of thing. My mom prepares all the food, which thank you so much, mom. Um, <laughs> shout out to my mom. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, sometimes though, like, uh, if, you know, one person is at home, like me and my brother will eat out a lot. Mm -hmm. We'll go for right. burgers or like order pizza. We eat a lot of Domino's pizza. Oh gosh. Um, we've actually had like a few pizzas for free because we eat there so much. <laughs> um, Not so yeah. much on the healthy side, but yeah. still like the indulging side. But yeah, but majority of the time, like we do eat dinner as a family. Like yeah. we always have, we have pasta a lot because my dad's Italian. Yeah. Um, so yeah. yeah, pasta, fish, chicken, all that stuff. That's yeah. great. Yeah. We try to eat. I live with my sister. We both have really busy jobs so like whoever's home first usually takes on the cooking if we That's can nice. when we go grocery shopping the way that we do it is we think ahead to the week and be like okay i'm home monday tuesday we can do dinner together that day oh right. wednesday thursday we're alone then we figure it out that way so we kind of have a plan going in on sunday into the week to see what we can prepare ahead of time and then we're big on making like bigger so then we can take leftovers the next day i love that yeah, yeah. so you can great. really and it's also kind of like economical to kind of yeah. to carry it over to the next day or the next lunch no yeah sure. exactly now you already kind of answered this because you had a go-to yes. recipe oh, right, right. <laughs> salmon. salmon yeah do you have one now that you make like for example if you have extra time or if you just you like you know what i'm just really good at the salmon <laughs> okay, I respect that. minutes in a 420 oven like you got like this absolute beautiful fish, so I'm gonna stick with that. Okay, do you have one? I don't know, not really. Like you gotta make one. I don't. I don't you know, know. like okay. a go-to that I have often. I can't think of any right now. Mine's stir fry. Here. Oh, that's good. I that's love fun. making your stir fry. Like everything that's left over in the fridge, you can put as many veggies as you want. Yeah, eat everything, everything goes good. All it has to do with is like, you need like a soy sauce and then you're good to go. Yeah. I like to do like teriyaki sauce, sweet and yeah. sour, mm -hmm. um, like a pineapple chicken. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm getting hungry. I know, me too. <laughs> okay, well then we'll do one more question because we're all right. getting a little hungry over here. So when it comes to the work week, because of course we spend a lot of time here in the Top Knot office, mm -hmm. do you tend to buy your lunch or do you tend to pack lunch to bring in? Uh, well, since, <laughs> since I started working here, I've been bringing my lunches more often, but I also work at McDonald's, so every shift that I have there, I'm eating McDonald's food. Every really? single shift. Every shift. And you're not sick of it? 
Never. Not even because it's McDonald's, just because it's something that's you eat a lot. Never. A lot of. Never. I like because I'm there so much. Like I could just keep eating it. It's absolutely unbelievable. I might yeah. go work at McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. I mean, my favorite dish at McDonald's is always going to be chicken. What's oh, yeah. yours? Junior chicken. <laughs> Love the nuggets. Nuggets are so Give good. Give me a nuggie. What's your sauce that you go to? Oh, sweet and sour. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Sweet and Always. sour. Yes. Yeah. But like with a little honey and a little mayo. Yes. And a little ketchup. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> what so good. good. <laughs> All right, on that note, I'm going to wrap this up because we're going to take a trip to McDonald's as we talk about healthy eating. And um, we hope you have a wonderful week. Yeah, we'll talk to you soon. Bye, Bye. guys. Bye.